let's take a look at my top five hypervisors for 2025, all of which can help you create virtual machines for training as well as production environments. But which one will come out on top? Coming in at number five is Oracle's Virtual Box. One of the issues that I've had with Virtual Box is support for OSs are a little bit limited and it's a little bit unstable. Coming in at number four is Hyper-V. This can normally be found in Windows Server and or Windows 10 and 11. One really useful feature that this hypervisor has is that you can use something called dynamic memory, which is awesome. Hyper-V is, of course, one of the founding technologies that makes Microsoft Azure uh, possible. Coming in at my number three is a free product. So this is VMware Fusion. It's got a really nice range of virtual machines. A little caveat here, you'll need to go in and you'll need to add additional drivers, of course, for any kind of hard, special hardware that you've got. Coming in at my number two is Parallels. One unique feature that Parallels has got is the fact that you can actually install macOS in a virtual machine, which is really nice, actually. Now, my number one solution is this. This is UTM. You've got access to not just Windows 11, but also previous versions of Windows, Linux, and others as well. Do you agree with the list? Would have you included something else? I would love to know. Make sure you get that down in the comments below.